Click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, I welcome you all to this video. We are with chapter 4 of Microwave Engineering, a family of transferred electron devices we are considering onto the semiconductor platform to generate the microwave signal or a microwave energy we can say. The very popular gun diode we are already covered with the various modes of operation we have covered understanding the gun effect along with the RWS theory and practice of few problems onto it. In the previous video we are covered with the LSA diode. So let us make a practice of performance calculation with respect to this device. So here we start with our topic and here we are provided a problem statement. The problem statement is an LSA oscillator has the following parameters. The conversion efficiency is denoted here with the symbol eta. The value it is 0.06. There it is a multiplication factor represented as capital M having the value 3.5. The threshold field E suffix th is having the value 320 kilo volts per meter. The device length is represented by capital L holds the value 12 micrometers. The donor concentration represented by n suffix 0 holds the value 10 to the power 21 per meter cube. Average carrier velocity is represented as v suffix 0 and has the value 1.5 into 10 to the power 5 meter per second. Lastly, the area is represented as capital A and it has the value 3 into 10 to the power minus 8 meter square here. We are asked to determine the value of the output power in terms of milliwatts. So here we are provided a lot many parameters with respect to this LSA diode working as oscillator and now we can compute the output power. So let us have the output power given by the formula. The output power can be simply represented as capital P and it can be expressed in the form of efficiency denoted by eta. In the bracket here we have multiplication factor M into the threshold electric field value ETH into the device length L. In the second bracket we have the concentration denoted by N sub 0 into the electric charge E the velocity V0 and finally the area capital A. So here we have total 8 parameters onto which we can make computation of output power. So very first of all conversion efficiency we substitute eta as 0.06. In the bracket we can substitute the multiplication factor that it is 3.5 into the threshold value of electric field here it is 320 into 10 to the power 3 in place of kilo so that the value can be in terms of SI system of units here. Now here we require the device length. The device length L can be substituted with 12 into 10 to the power minus 6 in terms of meters. So the first bracket is in multiplication to the second bracket that has the concentration is given as 10 to the power 21 into the electric charge 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 into here we have the velocity of electron the velocity is given as 1.5 into 10 to the power plus 5 into lastly the area can be given in terms of 3 into 10 to the power minus 8 meter square. So thus we have substituted all these 8 parameters. Now let us make a simple multiplication among them and we obtain the next step as 0.06 into 13.44 into 7.2 into 10 to the power minus 1 it will be. So this simplified multiplication further gives us the value 581 into 10 to the power minus 3. So this is the value obtained for the output power. The SI system of units gives the measurement in terms of watts. 
therefore I express T is equal to 581 into 10 to the power minus 3 watts here. As per the problem statement, we require the output power in terms of milliwatts. Therefore, 10 to the power minus 3, we can absorb and express the value in terms of milliwatt. So finally, we write the output power P is equal to 581 milliwatts here. The value is outlined here. So after completion of the output power calculations, now in the next lecture, we shall be addressing the next diode in the family of transferred electron devices. The diode is called as indium phosphide diode represented as INP. I hope you are definitely enjoying the details of microwave engineering that we share with you. For more information like this, you can subscribe to Ikeda channel. Thank you.